could use this to melt ice. Ah. Yes. Maybe I can find something useful in here. There we go. Gramophone needle. Music sheet. Capricorn. Propeller. Pine nuts. Sagittarius. Metronome. Steen. That is Aquarius. Uh huh? Oh, there we go. Wax seal. Nope. Uh wax seal. Oh, it's actually the seal itself, not the wax with the seal stamp didn't do it. <laughs> that specification is important. Chief wax seal. It's literally just a needle. Oh, here we go. Capricorn. I don't. What could that be? Oh, here we go. Handkerchief. Wax seal in Aquarius. And a wax seal and a hint. Oh, there it is. Found it! It's the musical score of the Symphony of Fire. Oh, finally. About damn time we found that. Where am I? Something on the conservatory grounds I still need. Blue gem hiding above an oddly placed graves. Again, the Abergrove spoke to me, telling me to venture to a place up above, a place where he knew the heavens were watching and laughing. Oh, well, I need to head there anyway. heart out of the rooftop. Again, the opera spoke to me, telling me to venture to where the th thoughts and words of many were kept. First. Fine. Alright, let's go shoot Raul down. I gave you my music. I gave you everything. Yeah, but you know what? You can't tell what the heart's gonna do. You can't be bitter about losing someone when, you know... Shoot him down. Alright. Cut these two apart. Is this how you repay your angel of music? Yep. Definitely. Um what else do I need to do? Oh, books. Right. Library. Wrong way. This way. There we go. You will find the red gem of life where there is only death. The pinker was sitting among some books in the library when I touched the upper ghost. It was furious. He shouted that his heart can never venture far from him. I wonder. <laughs> I freaking wonder, Skyward Sword. Alright, well, I need to go and play the Bordello of Fire. Oh, wait, no, that's the Ocarina of Time. Never mind. Wrong one. Symphony of Fire. That's right. And here we go. Music. I am your angel of music. 
Okay then. The light from the furnace revealed a strange pattern on the wall. It looks like a le the Lyra constellation, but I'm not entirely sure. Alright, well we need to go this way anyway for its heart. This looks strange. Oh, candles. What? Oh. oh. Alright, okay. It's just like a game of checkers. I was sitting among some skulls in the crypt when I picked it up it felt warm to the touch. I almost feel as if I can't part with it. All I hear now is him whispering my mother's name. Hopper boxes. Hopper boxes, what? That says pay. I need to leave it up there somehow, but I don't know how. I have this half mask. I don't know what to do with it. All the hearts. Oh, but I need the other half of the mask. I even have this. What am I missing? That, those are the only two places. I need some opera glasses, but I. Oh. Found them. Gotta love it when it's just, you know, right there in plain sight, waiting for you to just take it. Perfect. Gotta love it. Alright, let's see. Up we go. Let's see what we can see. Um, okay. <gasps> Shit! <laughs> Stupid jump scares! My heart nearly leapt out of my chest. What does the opera ghost want from me? Why does he torment me so? Oh, cruel fate, will this nightmare never end? Oh, here, take it. Oh, don't open your eyes, don't do that. Um. Whew, okay. Uh. uh half mask, black rose, evil jacket. Recording, let's play. So I'm talking to myself. Well, technically I'm talking to the audience. Helmet. Uh, candelabra. Is it? Yep. Golf ball, signet. Signet ring. Oh, there. Cake. Skull. Mask. Opera glasses. Black rose. Cracker. <laughs> okay. Opera glasses. Telescope. Hmm. No? Black rose. Oh, crack. <laughs> That's a giant cracker. Uh, telescope. Golf ball. Um. Hmm. <laughs> I found the comb. Not that I need a comb, but I found it. Golf ball. Medieval jacket. Where did I use that? Oh, okay. That's a giant bobby pin. Uh. Huh. No. Oh, come on. Oh, found it. Alright. 
Got it. All right. The opera ghost's mask, but only half of it. Don't worry. I already found the other half. We are good to go. We got all that we need. Let's go get the opera ghost. Tell him we want out and then make him send us back. Okay. What was the stage notes? Oh, here they are. Okay. Uh, matrons in pink. Uh, heroes in blue. Okay, here we go. So, black, blue, pink, red, white. Black, blue, pink, red, white. Hey man, what's up? Are you ready to descend into my realm? Bring me another black rose. Well, um, actually, <laughs> I want you to send me back. The ghost appeared in the mirror of my mother's changing room, asking me for a single black rose. I wonder if she's... I wonder if she had ever seen him there. I wonder. Here we go. On that night, you broke my heart. But now, you have made me whole again. Really? What, you just wanted someone to solve all your puzzles for you? I hate her dress. I hate having to find these things in her dress. Uh, and in her hair. It's so annoying. Uh, two more. Could it be hiding? Is that it? No. That's not it? Ah, oh, this is the last one. There we go. Done. Done! That's it! I had given her everything, yet she chose him over me. The pain I felt then would pale in comparison to the destruction that breaks. <laughs> I love it. I saw my father propose to my mother. They were on the roof of the opera house under a beautiful starry Why sky. Did you leave me? How romantic. Little do they know the opera ghost was lurking nearby, looking on in anger, yet he seemed so heartbroken. Through this very mirror, I taught you how to sing. Oh, well. Why did you bring me here? Destiny brought us both here. Uh, no. Come. Wait, where are you taking me? I'm not who you think I am. Have you forgotten your angel of music already? I shall show you everything and make you remember. Uh, well... Welcome to my realm. Here, our lives will begin anew. This time, you will stay with me forever. Ugh, this can't be real. Well, all right, and that is the end. Well, for the most part, heartsick for his beloved, the Phantom attempted one last time to win back Christine. Yet fate is not without irony, for it was Evelina, the daughter of the woman he loved and the man he swore to kill, who was spirited away by the opera ghost. For him, this might prove to be the perfect revenge. By keeping Evelina, he would have his love while he while causing those who betrayed him to suffer. Would Evelina be able to warm the fragile and reckless heart of the phantom and be free? Or would he become her angel of music forever? Well... That's it. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. So, that's the end. Well, not really. We have one more thing to do.
We have this little uh, extras thing. We have a bonus level at the end, which is just a bit of insight. Still cool, still fun. And uh, yeah, that's why at the beginning I said I could picture a sequel for this game where Christine freaks out and goes to the real opera house, because I'm pretty sure this is like some sort of ghost one. And so like, it's the same layup, all the puzzles and challenges are different, and like she keeps seeing like images of the Phantom and her daughter, and she's trying to just like make her way through and figure out what happened, and because they're in the spirit realm and she's in the real world, so there could be some really cool back and forth things. I just think that'd be such a cool sequel, I'd love that. But uh, yeah, next time we'll uh, we'll play the bonus game, and until then, see ya!